What is going on guys? This is Doc R signing back into another Knights and Dragons video. How are you guys doing today? I am doing fabulous. It definitely seems like it's been a while. I've been recording a lot of different videos, doing a lot of different notes and those kind of things. So it has seemed like, for me at least, uh, forever since I made a video here on the channel. So going to be doing a kind of a quick overview of how I'm doing right now, kind of you know future plans and what I've been working on. And just kind of seeing what's going on right now in the Knights and Dragons community. So definitely want to keep uh, videos up to date with you guys. So I want to stay pretty close to a consistent basis. Usually about two to three videos a week. Hopefully you guys are enjoying them. I know that we've been getting a lot of likes. I definitely appreciate all the support. So let's just go ahead and jump right on into it, guys. So real quick here, we can see starter pack. I don't normally do any starter packs for some reason. Uh, I'm a free-to-play player. Haven't spent any money on the game. So just kind of how I am. Real quick, I like to point out the 1454 gems that we got. So I am saving up for that big run in August that we are going to be doing. Collect these incomes. Let's check, take a look at the news. So we still got this chest here. Not going to be doing any openings on that. Actually, I do have a question for you guys real quick. Uh, I was looking to create a second account possibly just to save gems and those kind of things. Possibly doing chess openings, something similar to this one once I get enough uh, gems. Let me know down in the comments below if you guys would like to see that, if I should do a second account for you guys. Or if you guys don't want to see it, just let me know down below. And whichever way that we do it, I, I'm kind of cool with. So, not a big deal. It looks like we have a Molten Warfare. Uh, I'm not going to get too into details with this right now because we will get into this later in the video. Also, Heroic Mode, which has been out for probably, I think, since this video is going to be released, it'll be out for two days for you guys. Let me know down in the comments below how you guys are doing. Stay tuned to find out how I'm doing. Guildwing Battle, not a big deal. PvP, P blah, blah, blah. words, PvP, yeah, same stuff. Alright guys, so the juice of the story, we're going to get right into here to Heroic Mode. So you guys can see I've got zero crystals. What I actually have going, Relic Runes done, Thieves Coves, Skeleton's Tomb, Flaming Wildwood, Cold Rock Crags, and Fairy Forest have all been completed. I did actually wake up early yesterday morning and got most of those knocked out. So I did use like all my friends on Fairy Forest mainly. I just don't really have a strong fire type it seems like. So... I am doing a recording. I got all the footage for these for the novice stages that's going to be put out. So if you guys are having trouble with these, stay tuned to that video. It's going to be coming up within the, the next couple videos. And it's going to help a lot, definitely, with Heroic. If it's not going to help you with this Heroic, it will help you with next Heroic. So definitely excited for that one. Let's take a look here real quick and see. There we go. So heroic, it looks like it's crafting about 50 hours. This video is probably going to go out tomorrow morning. So we'll probably be at about, you know, 40 hours kind of by then. Actually 42, it's pretty late right now. And let's see, I got arena attacks. We're not even going to bother with those. What I wanted to see is this molten warfare. So it doesn't look like we do have any content on it right now. As you can see, it didn't push me anywhere. So complete the set plus for a big bonus. Looks like that is a pretty big bonus. Almost 700 attack, 500 defense, and 100 health. That's pretty good. Um, I just want to know, you know, how many people are actually going to be going for this. It's a fire air, which I know isn't real popular in our community. Reason being, just with the, you know, the fire and the air, just I guess it's not a good combination or something like that. I think it's definitely good for me. Like this heroic, I'm definitely going to try pretty hard to get this heroic plus which I'll show you and just a little bit of where we're at for the heroic plus but the fire is really good to take out that spirit ie the fairy forest the wind is gonna be really good for water but it'll be countered which isn't really a big deal I'm not really looking for a wind armor I am definitely looking for a fire armor so we'll see I think we've been talking about maybe doing something this weekend I don't know I might just save those gems so We'll see. I'll, I'll definitely keep you guys posted and I'll let you guys know how it how it goes if we do do a run. Yeah, if we do do a run. Really fast. Let's look at leaderboards and I wonder. Let's see. So I'm top 200 right now for novice. I have done intermediate. And I'm at 123. So you guys definitely know that I've been working on that. 
Let me go here to the top leaderboards real quick and see if these guys are still here. Man, look at that. Back to back. So Donnie, number five in heroic mode at the moment with almost 50 million points or 50 million damage dealt. It looks like Christian is right behind with 39. Man, that is some serious work that those guys are putting in right there. I can't even believe that. Where? How much have I done? Let's see. What have we done? We have done... What is that? Two million? Let's see. Where am I? There I am. Yeah, two million points. Those guys are freaking beasts. Wow. Shout out to you, Christian. Shout out to you, Don. You guys are ridiculous. You guys take this game to a whole nother level. I just, I hope when I grow up as a Knights and Dragons player that I be like one of you. Either one. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> so let's take a look at Heroic. So I've got about four on here. Rhythming Cascades. We're going to skip these two because these two are blank. And then we're going to jump over here to Blazing Tides. Looks like I do. Oh, I've got one going right now. And full health. Look at that. Let's finish this one up real quick. Why not? We're here. We'll turn this on auto just so you guys don't see me clicking. So yeah, I just want to know how you guys are doing with your heroic mode, if you guys are doing okay. Let me know also if you guys are planning to get that plus armor. If you guys have any questions about the bling, I do have a video. I'll link it down in the description below of how I got the bling in previous heroics. So it shows you kind of all of the people that you guys are going to be facing. Gives you kind of an idea of what armors you guys should be wearing, what you should take, and also what friends that you should bring along with you. So... Let me know down in the comments below though how you guys are doing specifically. And that's kind of how I'm doing. And also, you know, are you guys looking to do this Molten Warfare? Like I said, for me, it'd be really awesome if I could get a, you know, a pretty sweet fire one. I don't really know if I want to spend all the gems. I think it's going to be about two. What is that? If I did get all my free energies, it'd be a couple hundred gems just to make sure that I can get the set. Because, of course, if you're going to get the armor, you're going to want the bling with it. So so that's kind of a thing there. Let's see. Is there anything else that I wanted to talk about? Heroic, war. Just kind of want to know how you guys are doing. Um, let's see. Oh, future for the... So, yeah. So I have been working quite a bit on, on some different videos. Like I said, I've got a heroic video that I'm going to be posting out. I've got a footage of each one of these ones. And also how to help you guys with heroic mode. If you guys remember in the previous video what we talked about was a couple different video ideas of what. I'm going to go ahead and do arenas here while, while I'm chatting it up with you guys. But as I spoke with in the previous videos, just some ideas and stuff like that that I wanted to do. And I have been working on those. I've been getting a couple notes and scripts down of kind of how I want those videos to play out. And just making sure I get all that information in for you guys. I got to try and condense it down into a sweet little video. Um, hopefully not, you know, any more than 10 minutes. Some of them might be a little longer than 10 minutes. And some of them actually might be shorter than 10 minutes. So we'll kind of see how long that they take. But, but from the videos that I am working on right now, um, one of them in particular, it seems like it's going to be quite, you know, kind of a longer video. But there's going to be definitely a lot of information. Wow, I'm getting slaughtered on that one. Wow, that guy beat me bad. But anyway, so yeah, a lot of these videos and stuff like that, there's going to be a lot of information in there. Um, for some people, it's going to be stuff that you already know. For other people, it's going to be a huge help. Like I know for wars and stuff like that, I still have so many people that ask me what MDR is, um, what's a strip war and points and, and just all that kind of fancy stuff. So it's going to explain a lot of those. And also, like I was saying before, if you guys have noobs, or new players and stuff like that that you know are entering your guild and they you know need to know these things you don't want to kind of explain it to every single one of them feel free and share my video with them they can watch a 10 minute video and know exactly what to do in war and you know help you help them and, and all those kind of things so um, but with that that's going to be kind of everything that I have guys this is kind of a you know a short video that I'm just coming out with just kind of giving you an update on where I am and what I have going on I also uh, did some videos for these for the Rithering Cascades Blazing Tides I also need to get one for the desert here 
and the sunken ship so I will get an intermediate guide along with a novice guide probably a new bling guide and hopefully this time and I should have enough time to go ahead and get this haunted uh, citadel so hopefully I can get that one I know for a fact that I'm not as busy this go round as I was last go round, so we'll kind of see but that's going to be everything guys if you enjoyed the video please make sure and leave a like and if you really enjoy the content please make sure and subscribe before you go this is Doc R signing out thanks YouTube